Now I will show how to configure JDBC template in Spring Boot. I will be using Spring Initializer to create the Spring Boot project and for configuring JDBC template we need these dependencies. One is Spring JDBC and H2 database and Spring Web. Spring Web is not necessarily required but I will use for testing the JDBC template. So now I am in Spring Initializer. So this is the URL start.spring.io and so I have selected Maven as the dependency management tool and I am using 3.0.6 as the Spring Boot version and this is the group ID you can give any name I am using com.jdbc template and artifact ID jdbc template you can use any artifact name any any artifact ID any artifact name and uh, I will leave it description as it is and package name I am just using com.jdbc template and packaging as jar and I am using java 17 and this is the main section the dependencies so we need these dependencies spring data jdbc h2 database and spring web so to add dependencies you just have to click on this add button and then search for, search for spring data Since I have added already, for now I will remove the spring data and click on this spring data. So now you see spring data JDBC. You have to select spring data JDBC, not spring data JPA. And after that, after you have added the H2 database, spring web, and spring data JDBC, you click on explore. Now you can see the dependencies that is the spring boot starter data jdbc spring boot starter web and h2 so i have already configured the spring initializer and downloaded the project so you just click on generate so that the spring boot project will be generated and open the same project in intellij so uh, Now I have created a controller JDBC test template controller to test the JDBC template. So you don't need to configure anything after that. You just have to create a controller or if you are using repository, then you have to create the repository and to configure JDBC template, you don't need to do anything. You just have to do add rate auto wide and the JDBC template private JDBC template JDBC template since we are using h2 database as the database so spring boot already knows the h2 database is present in the present at the runtime so it, it will only auto configures just for the testing purpose i am using h2 database in your productive scenario you have to use the real database like mysql or oracle so with the h2 database you don't need to configure anything jdbc only does the setup spring boot only does the setup so this is the one uh, for configuring you don't you just need to auto wire the jdbc template and after that just for the demo purpose i am creating a table using the jdbc dot execute and I will execute this create table API from Postman. So now I get the controller here and I create the table using JDBC template. Okay, this is saying the table already exist because I have already done the testing so I'll just restart it 
since h2 is the in memory database it doesn't store the data so whatever data that you have created already will be removed as soon as you restart the application so to test the jdbc template i will invoke the api again create table and now see the table is created and now here you see table created successfully so this is how we can configure jdbc template for the demo purpose i use the h2 database